Next week at 10 past 11, Andrew Cooper takes a close look at a piece of farmyard scenery we take for granted to explore the secret nature on a dry stone wall. BBC One's lineup for tomorrow evening looks like this. And at 7, Terry Wogan's guests include Peter Cushing, Impressionist Gary Wilmot, and the new Miss Ballroom Dancing 1986. Then at 7.35, American domestic comedy in It's Your Move, followed at 8 by Scott Free, when Selena Scott meets an ex-folk singer turned Scottish landowner, the Baron of Towie Barclay. Dear John gets an invitation to a party at half past eight. And then, after the nine o'clock news, at 9.30, Panorama reports on the uncertain state of French socialism, with an eye to next Sunday's general election in France. Finally, the Monday spy story stars Dirk Bogart and Ava Gardner in a story of ruthless blackmail on the international espionage scene. Permission to kill at ten past ten tomorrow night on one. On to the weather forecast now. And some dense fog patches are likely tonight, but they'll clear fairly quickly tomorrow, except near some coasts. Many places will start dry, but showers will develop by midday, especially in eastern England and Scotland, where some could be quite heavy. Most western areas will have a dry afternoon with quite a lot of sunshine. Temperatures tomorrow will range from 7 degrees Celsius, 45 Fahrenheit in the east, to 9 or 10 Celsius, near 50 degrees Fahrenheit in some western areas. Just before we close, you might like to know that Her Majesty the Queen's official message to the Commonwealth will be broadcast for the first time as part of the Midnight News on BBC Radio 4. And Radio 2 is still going strong as well. At the moment, Desmond Carrington has a programme of listeners' favourite music. And then at 1am, Ken Bruce will be along for two's best. We hope you've enjoyed the evening on BBC One. And on behalf of everyone here, this is Lorna Thomas wishing you good night. <laughs>